2020 census less than a week away. Census count is one of the ways the federal government decides how much money is allocated to our communities. The Michigan executive director of the 2020 census says the state of Michigan receives about $30 billion from the federal government based on the census count. Roughly $3,000 a person, $30,000 per person over a decade. And these are tax dollars we're already paying to the federal government. So we want to bring them back to our communities. The population in mid Michigan's major cities have fallen since the last census in 2010. In Saginaw, the percentage dropped by 6.1 percent. Bay City down 5.5 percent and Flint also down 6.1 percent. Carrie Ebersole Singh says participating in this year's census is in your best interest and the communities. It's super easy. Uh, it's only nine questions and it impacts our communities for the next decade. Also new this year, a more convenient way of filling out the census. So this is your first opportunity to fill out your census form online and then you can also complete the form through the phone or uh, by a paper form. But officials warn to be on the lookout for possible scams and not to give away important information like your social security number or credit card information. Reporting in Saginaw County, Jamie Sherrod, WNEM TV5.